Hello there everybody and welcome back to Mega Aquarium. Yep, that's right, I decided to scrap both of the recordings I did earlier today, not just the one where I kept getting interrupted. Because I'm having more fun with this than I was having with the actual campaign mission. So, screw the campaign mission, we're here to just make an aquarium and watch it slowly run out of money and burn to the ground. Or make loads of money and go on to become popular, whichever comes first. So, we are making a very, very, very linear aquarium, apparently. I mean, it's, uh, we've got our fully grown um, coral grouper, or whatever it's called. We've got a very poly poly good. I can't say it. Polygi polygon polygon ah oh, frick it. Uh, some more fish. There's some more fish. And uh, can you guess what's in the next tank? That's right, more fish. And a new day. Hold on. Hold on. I know this is a strict error. Oh no, she is actually holding it with her hands. It kind of looked like she was using telekinesis for a moment. Oh, look, look, he's using telekinesis! He's using telekinesis to, uh... Oh, you can walk in the tank as well. Hello, fishies! <laughs> I'm having more fun doing this than I am anything else at the moment. Oh, I do like it. It's Cloud Strife, everyone! Cloud Strife has come to say hello to the fish. Oh, wait, no, it's not. No, but the hair... Kind of reminded me of him for a minute, but then I actually looked at his face and I was like, oh. At least that's what I remember Cloud Stripe looking like in the hair. Uh, I should probably sort of come out of that now. I was just waiting for that to take down. There we go, we got a nice bonus there. Okay, do we have any other. No, we don't. So now we're just waiting for other things to happen. Uh, right, now this is a bully. So this particular fish cannot be housed with anything. Jesus. <laughs> Suddenly I'm getting hiccups. Um, cannot be housed with any wimps. Luckily, they don't bully each other. And, well... Uh, can I get through? Can I get four of those in there? I don't think I can. How big were they? Uh, three. It's only twelve space. I do not have twelve space. Not in the slightest. So yeah, I can't really put a uh, King Demoiselle in the with the Moisel. Whatever. I don't know. Pronunciation was never my strong point. But we can put. Uh, Let's see. Put a yellow tang in there. The yellow tang would be quite happy. Okay, they're not exactly happy at the moment because of the whole, you know, dying thing, but nah, details. And power filter. And we're just one short, so I think we're going to need to put some rocks in there. So apparently that increases filtering capacity. I still don't know how that works. If anyone in the comments would like to explain how that works, I go right ahead. Because I am actually kind of interested to, to know how that is, uh, actually affects it. Uh, let's put a... Where do we put the barrel? It's like shooting fish in a barrel. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh, shut up. Okay. Uh, then, I think we will increase that by that. Just so they can get around the other side. And we need to, we need to go over there with that. Right, that's perfect. Excellent. So, we now have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven decent looking tanks. And we have more people needing the toilet. I should probably move along a bit. Uh, 
and then we will put in the walls. Yep. That's incorrect. Learn to put walls in. Yeah, that was incorrect. Yeah, learn to put walls in, you donut. Goes there. And we paint it. Shipwreck. And whoa, 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 whoa. And where are the toilets? Toilets, 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 toilets in the refreshment section. And a sponge sink. Just in case they get dirty. Lovely. Alright, we're also going to hire a new staff member. We're going to try and get one that focuses on cleaning and eh, fixing and talking. Oh, that could work well as well. Yeah, we'll get we'll get you. Seems relatively decent. And now, oh oh oh, that's gr they've grown, so the uh, filtering of that tank has gone. Mm. Uh, well, I can still feed it from the side, so we'll put a power filter in there. Anyone else? Uh, can I get rid of all these windows, please? It's getting a tad annoying. Right, I think we need some more refreshments as well around here, so we shall. Yes, I know, I'm getting your refreshment. Hold on. Uh, there we go. <laughs> and it just appeared before their very eyes. Clearly, everyone in this place is magic. Uh, I do. As much as I uh, make fun of the game for its limitations, I do really like this game. Despite the fact I've not actually played it that much recently. I... I'd say it's actually fairly fun for what it is. I mean, as I've said before, graphics aren't everything. I mean, come on, I played Doom 1993 still, for Christ's sake. Despite the fact one of the people at work actually makes fun of me for it because he says, Oh, how can you play that? It's so old and the graphics look so... Well, terrible. But... I can play it because it's fun. I just splotted a bl splotted? Spotted a blue bit. Yay, Panther Grouper! Uh, next. Hmm. The bleak line dotty back. Why not? I guess we'll just go in order for the moment. Right. We are getting quite a lot of customers now. It's day seven. Oh, we have. Ah, let's just uh, tell me that things have grown. I assume this filtering still okay. It is, but it's only one off. But they're fully grown now, so we don't care. Uh, anything else gone wrong? No, I don't look it. I really like that small rocks. That's not how you use grammar. I've already seen Driftwood Co Cave. Uh, I think I need to... You can only have three in your aquarium. Really? I'm actually a tad concerned that... People are going to get sort of stuck in a loop. Like they're going to follow that arrow, go around, then go back and follow that arrow again because they've walked over it. Because if that does actually happen, then I'm going to start... Ooh, hello. Greetings, my name is Elise von Sorlag. Sorlig. I am something of an aquatic enthusiast. I would love to sponsor one of your exhibits, if you'll allow me. I wouldn't want to tread on your toes, but if you insist on insisted on my input, something with the following parameters per yeah, parameters would please me immensely. Build a tank with four fox face rabbit fish. Wow, you're gonna give me nearly eight thousand over eight thousand. Yeah, you're gonna give me about nine thousand two hundred just for that. I that's a deal. 
Once I have... Oh, and six lionfish. Ooh. I mean, they can be housed together, right? Yeah, so I'm just going to be able to tank for them. A really, really big tank. And that would be great. Uh, large heater. I do kind of need deep tanks, though. I'm going to start getting lionfish in. Do I have the fish that she is after? It does not look like it. No, I'm going to need to research it. Uh, fox face rabbit fish. It's that one there. I'm, I'll not abandon my research so soon. Uh, we're starting to. Things are starting to break more frequently. And we're also probably going to start running out of food. We also need more food pellets, don't we? Okay, we'll get an, we'll get some more pellets along the walls. Uh, that's the wrong one. Yeah, that is the one I want. Let's get another tool station over there. And let's get... Mussels. Let's get green. And let's get orange. There we go. That will make it a bit quicker to get to them. Uh, we have got two fixes, haven't we? Yes, but everyone's busy. Uh, we're going to need more people. Uh, fixing a gift shop. Well, we don't have a gift shop yet, but fixing would be somewhat useful. As I start getting more complicated mechanical things, it's definitely going to be worth it. So that's their priorities. Right. Okay, yeah. I did learn that in the uh, scrapped videos. So... Right. Is that... Did I not deal with that? There we go. Right, you need the toilet, but for some reason or another you're not going. There we go. <clears throat> okay. Oh, another one! I found another one! I'm disappointed in myself. Right. Has anyone missed feeding? Because if they have, I need to know. Let's talk tank and view. Actually, let's not bother with tank. So everyone is seeing every tank. Right. That's that's something. I'm so concerned about this though. It doesn't look like people are getting stuck. So I need the warnings. Make sure you give me the warnings. Or is that toggling warnings off? Uh, I might be toggling the warnings off, actually. That might be... T yeah, that's going to be toggling all them off. Isn't it? Good to have that, though, just so I can see what I'm getting from each tank. Right. So, where do we go next? Uh, well, we unlocked the fox-faced fox rabbit fish, so we can do that... Uh, wealthy benefactor thing. Uh, I'm tempted to get those lionfish. I think I will. Luckily, they will stay in my inventory until uh, such a time that I feel like they need to be used. I'm tempted to get some observer tanks and stick them that side in this corridor here. Now, do I make the corridor like that? No, I would need to put the tanks here, wouldn't I? And then put stuff all there so I can hide these from their from this customer's view. Hmm. Maybe putting a corner tank wasn't the best idea. It's kind of interfered with my plan a bit. So, or well, it's more thrown me off than anything else. So let's do that. 420. So if I was to put in, say, an observer tank, 
How much can I get that up to? 30. What's the fish level? Oh yeah, 30. Do we? So exactly the same as the these tanks. I I could put a lagoon in. Cause those fish are gonna need a lot of water. And let's put in a lagoon seal then. Right, we'll see what that can get up to. That can get up to 88. That is more than enough. Right. And then we will put a little room back here. That's all the filtering and stuff can go in. That is not 5 by 5 There we go. Right, so, basic pump. That there, get it there, and then we can put in another one if we need it, which we will. I can assure you. Are you going to let me put that? You are going to let me put that there. Good. Uh, so that's now got 90 filtering capacity. I don't think I showed off how those worked in the uh, other video, but yeah, it is. Okay, okay. Um, I feel like this area should be sectioned off. So, can I put, I can't put a specific paint on each side, can I? But then that is also sandy, so, you get the feeling that putting the shipwreck thing. Uh, I don't know. I mean, it looks nice, but I kind of want a different colour scheme for this area. We'll keep it as this for now. I'm no doubt going to come back to this, so I'm sure someone will leave a comment saying uh, to change it. Right, so where are those fish? They can grow up to 11, so that's already 66 right there. They will eat. They may eat or damage fish size 2 or less. Uh, crustaceans with size 2 or less. So, uh, they should probably not. Oh wow, that was really low of the tank quality. Okay, we're going to need a second big filter for that one. Uh, filter, 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 that, there we are, thank you, and I need 88, I need 3 power, um, okay, let's put in another, um, where is it? Let's put another one in, and that should get me up to, ah, so you can actually link pumps to pumps, by the looks of it, kind of, sort of, not really, uh, uh, let's put that in there, and we want the driftwood cave, and another driftwood cave over there, right, so that's them sorted, we want muscles, so, Probably expand this out this way a bit. And get ourselves a muscle dispenser. Um, that's 157 science right there. That is like ridiculous. That's going to almost double our science output. And to all those saying, oh, it's not efficient, I don't care. Right, now I'm going to need something somewhat substantial to go in with them. So, what about this panther grouper? 
I mean, that's pretty substantial. And generates a lot of science and eats muscles. So... There we go. But is that going to be too big, I wonder? Uh, most of these videos just me clicking around trying to find things. I'm concerned I've actually put too many fish in there, but we'll find out. Look at the signs from that. Lovely. There's 214 signs in there. Look at that. It's going up like the um, something that goes up really, really quickly. I don't know. Air balloon on fire. <laughs> I was never good at analogies. Uh, large heater unlocked. Good. And I can replace those heaters there. Uh, protein skimmer or deep pool tank? Uh, probably deep pool tank. Well, the protein skimmer will be useful for coral. Let's get a protein skimmer. Why not? It's also useful for filtering, I think. If I remember correctly. Uh, right, so we can sell that, that, that. And then we can replace it with a large heater there. And that is instantly enough to power that tank. Now, there water quality is going to go down, so I'm going to put in a large filter. The only issue is, is that no one can actually get to that pump if that breaks down. If that breaks down, we're kind of scuppered. So, yay. I don't even know if that can break down, actually. And then... On that side will be a fizzy drink vending machine! Woohoo! In fact, two, because, you know, redundancy and everything. And a bin. Where's a bin? Bin. There. And put one there as well. Right, now you two can go over there and get your drinks. You can sit on the bench, and you can sit on the bench as well. Apparently that person does not want to sit on the bench. That person just wants to leave. Okay. Right. I've... Yeah! Prestige rank four. I thought I was five. I am five! Woo! I can now get some new things. Harborside paint. Chocolate vending machines. Basic chillers for the cold water fish. Feather Pra. This algae sends chain sends out chains of runners that attach to rocks and substrate. Shoots of feathery foliage grow all angles of the runners. Ooh. Fancy. Nets. Yes, because that's a good idea in a fish tank. And a palm tree. Okay. Oh, I totally want to put a palm tree in there. Sorry, it just has to be done. Oh, it won't fit. Oh, unless... Is that, is that is that a land thing? Yeah, that's, that's a land thing. Oops. Let's put it there. I mean, we're not putting anything there, so we might as well. And then... Anything else? nets in there just to annoy the fish. Yep, the, the fish seem pretty significantly annoying. That in fact one's been chopped in half. Uh, in fact two have been chopped in half technically. Only 62% of people are seeing that. I think this calls for another arrow of doom. We shall lead you to your demise. It is this way. We'll just, ch we'll just uh, chuck in the tank. There we go, that'll sort of things. That's what happens to people who litter. 
I wonder when I start getting sharks. I mean, you've got to get sharks. It's an aquarium. Sharks and whales and all that sort of thing. I went to an aquarium once and I uh, came across a shark I had not seen before called a nurse shark, I think it was called. And, um... Well, it didn't look like it got on very well with one of the other fish who had a giant chunk missing out of its tail. Seems like they had a bit of an argument. But, eh. Alright, that one's dirty. Um, is there anyone to clean that? Do we have any cleaners? Well, we do have cleaners, but I can't remember who it was. Uh, Gar Gabri, where are you? You're feeding someone at the moment. No, you're, uh, you're fixing the equipment. Right. Right, uh, can, I, can we pick you up? We can't pick you up. No, we can pick you up. We just have to click that button. I'm trying to play it like Dungeon Keeper for some reason. So it looks like they're heading that way anyway. Yeah, they are. Right, they're cleaning that. Good. Um, oh dear. We really are going through the old, uh... Okay, um... I think we should probably put a little offshoot here, just for some more toilets. Right, uh... I mean, you can't really have too many of these. I mean, I'm guessing that these have these toilets here have like inbuilt sinks or something because, well, you know, you need to wash your hands after you've been to the toilet. It's only hygienic. We're not like in Central Africa or something, which I don't know is that, you know, I don't know how the regions of Africa work. In like. I don't know if that's actually the worst part of Africa, or if there are worse parts than that. I don't know. My geography is terrible. And yes, I know that's not actually geography. I'm just trying to make a point. Don't take what I say with a grain of salt. I mean, I, I give out enough salt, so... Especially given those last few Doom videos. I just basically said stuff you, I'm just jumping my way through the levels. Uh right. Let's close all those down. And oh yeah, I need to work on my rabbit fish thing, don't I? Uh fox or rabbit fish, good. Uh longhorn cowfish. Reef squirrel fish. Can we get the reef squirrel fish? Interested in some That's a freaking shark! That is a goddamn shark. This animal eats sand eel. Oh, I want that. How do I get it? How do I get the cuckoo? The cuckoo ra ras. How do I get that? I want that. Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me, give me shark. Oh, I can research. Alright, okay, well that's something to keep in mind for the future. Because I want that goddamn shark. I mean, that'd be a great centerpiece, don't you think? As long as it doesn't eat all the other fish. I, I assume that, that will eat fish, right? No, only crustaceans. It won't eat fish. This shark prefers to walk rather than swim, using its stiffened underfins to walk across the seabed. The epaulette, epaulette will even use its curious talent to climb out of the water entirely to access more exciting tidal pools. So it's kind of a crab muncher. Okay. Well. I guess we shall focus towards getting that then. Once we've done this uh, this little quest here, so that will have to wait for the moment because it is now the end of the video. So thank you very much for watching, everybody. I hope you have enjoyed it, and 
Until tomorrow, when uh, we figure out what kind of a video I actually want to go to next. I mean, I downloaded Fear. Because, well, I like Fear. I don't know if I'm going to play it for the channel. I probably will, actually, to be fair. But, again, I'm just up. I'm debating that. So, um... Yeah, that'll be it for today. So, thank you very much for watching, everybody. I hope you have a good and until next time, I have been Kildaris. Goodbye.